Construction workers dig up a body this morning. Good evening. I'm Angela Taylor. And I'm Marius Payton. The construction crews have been working on the property for three weeks in Durham, but didn't turn up anything suspicious until today. CBS 17's Derek Lewis is live tonight in Durham getting answers about the body and the investigation. Derek. Marius and Angela, I am on South Austin Avenue near NCCU next to that Burger King. The man's body was found in a hole here behind me at this construction site. One neighbor tells me she had a feeling that trouble was coming to this area. Wendy Bivens lives along South Austin Avenue, an area she's called home for 50 years. And it's along this busy stretch of road, Wendy knew something wasn't quite right. Well, I was actually concerned as soon as they said they would be closing this road. The road has been closed for three weeks because of work on a bridge upgrade. After having the weekend off, I'm told five construction workers showed up here around 7 Monday morning. That's when one of them found a man's body in a hole. It's nerve wracking to see so much police activity and just to know that there's a dead body and to know that something life-threatening happened. Bivens tells me now at night there aren't any cars or lights in the area, so this doesn't surprise her. I knew because it was dark it would be an area of, of concern. Bivens says with motion lights at her home and an alarm system, she's done what she can to stay safe. I don't know what else I can do. It's up to public safety to me to keep this area patrolled and on their radar. Now, I'm still checking with police to find out if they are investigating this as a homicide or an accidental death. Police want you to give them a call if you were in the area or if you've heard anything or seen anything related to this case. Live in Durham, I'm Derek Lewis, CBS 17 News.